everybody Ann here yep I got the truck started again today it's unbelievable um, so yeah I've had my coffee already it's actually 12 31 o'clock right now in total today I got six eggs uh, so each hen laid an egg it's starting to come down um, it's kind of like sleet right now and it's I don't know maybe close to 1 p.m. Um, I have opened up the coop and I've put down some bedding outside so that they could walk to get to the little, the run and I've put some seeds and whatnot out there for them to eat because they are getting they're they're going crazy inside that van. Um, two of the leghorns have blood on the back of their neck. Now I know sometimes the rooster will latch onto them right at the back of the neck, but um, I, I've never seen him do that before and. Um, so I'm thinking that maybe two of the leghorns got into a fight. Um, one of them was Patsy, and I don't know who the other one was. I didn't look close enough, but just a little bit of blood back on their feathers. Uh, so yeah, that kind of bothered me. So uh, I'm getting, I'm giving them an option to go outside. You know, to go outside and entertain themselves, um, if need be. Uh, if they don't want to be, they can go back up into the van. I've been changing out water. I mean, basically just more of the same stuff. Um, today, I was blessed. Mr. Lucas called uh, while I was on the phone to the vet. And uh, so I called him back and um, he asked if uh, I wanted to go to town because he knew I was afraid to drive in this weather and he's <laughs> he's not fearful at all. He was, uh, he came from Chicago. So uh, he's used to this. I'm used to, I'm used to driving in the snow too, but on treated roads. <laughs> Uh, so he took me into town and uh, we got my propane tank filled. So I've got uh, two almost full propane tanks. I'm going to be able to make it through. Um, I'm still using the wood burning stove, but as you all know, most of my wood is green, so it's hard to get it going. Um, he gave me some cedar and I burned it last night and that burned nice and hot and it, I mean, it just burned really well. Uh, so next year, next winter is going to be different. Uh, me and Lu Mr. Lucas have both decided that <laughs> we're going to be cutting up wood all spring and summer long uh, to be more prepared because if something like this happens, you're going to need it. So I, I am still using the wood burning stove um, and the propane heater. And I'm going to make it through this. It's really hard. So I talked to the vet and... Uh, <laughs> No, he's not going to make it to his appointment tomorrow, so we rescheduled for next Wednesday. And one thing I didn't understand, I thought he was going to start his injections with his next appointment. No, all they do is uh, take his blood, do some x-rays and stuff like that, and as a result, then we move forward depending on um, what the situation is, what his labs and his x-rays look like. So... I'm a little disappointed about that. Well, number one, that he's not going to be able to be seen tomorrow. And number two, that he's not actually starting his heartworm treatment on his next appointment. It's just testing. So, I don't know. This is just going to be delayed. I'm just hoping and praying that it's not anything more delayed. Um, I believe everything's going to be okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to make this a short one today. Oh, the kids are out back. They're sledding now. They're just sledding down down the street because it's like solid ice, basically. Um, and I'm at the bottom of the hill, so they're having a good time. Anyway, uh, Papa got out and he didn't want to come back. He loves running in this snow. He just loves being out. He would just be wallowing in the snow all day long. So he got out and he went and chased the kids. Didn't chase them, but just wanted to go up and meet them. Meet them and they were all, all the way up the street. So I can't let him out anymore like that I don't know what I'm gonna do I just need a fenced in yard that's all there's to it um he always comes back but I'm trying to get him to stop running around you know what I mean but anyhow um so yeah my, my chickens are still laying eggs every single day I get between four and six eggs every day and I think that's fantastic Mr. Lucas is too um, so I don't know there may not be a video tomorrow or the next day I'm not sure uh, just because there's nothing going on aside from the freezing cold weather if I don't do a video I will post something on my community page letting you know how I am but I'm doing great um, I'm keeping warm except for when I go outside it takes me like a half an hour to get warmed up once I come back inside um, and I'm looking I've got a nice fire going I can see the, the smoke going up the chimney 
Um, I'll let you know on the community page what's going on and whatnot. Um, just say prayers that we get through this. I mean, because the people out here are not used to this kind of weather. And I personally don't like it myself one bit. Anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. For watching everybody i hope you enjoyed the video make sure you like subscribe hit the bell and y'all have a good one